Hi everyone, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to Vanity Wagon's latest video. I'm Kinjal Gupta and today I'm going to be busting all your myths about our favorite product which is a sunscreen. So without any further ado, let's get started. Sunscreens have always been and continue to be understated in most beauty kitties. They lie at the bottom and are considered far less important than our beloved nail paints and lipsticks. But guess what? Here's your wake up call. A sunscreen is almost as basic as your moisturizer or lip balm and I'm not even putting that up for a debate. And by the time I'm done, you'll be convinced about never skipping that sunscreen ever again. So let's start. All right, question number one, why should I apply a sunscreen? I mean, why should you not? During the day, sunscreen is a critical skincare step to combat the UV damage and prevent the signs of aging, including fine lines and pigmentation. The trick is to get your hands on the right formulation suiting your skin type. I firmly recommend at least going for SPF 30 or above to protect your skin. And here are a couple of options. Moving on to question number two, do I need to apply sunscreen indoors? Yes, of course. It's a non-negotiable skincare step. Rain or shine, you cannot skip sunscreen or miss sunscreen no matter what. Even indoors, you need to protect your skin from the hazardous blue light emanating out of your gadgets like phones, laptops and etc. This light is very much capable of penetrating deep into your skin and damages adversely. It also speeds up the skin aging process, so always remember to minimize the brightness settings and slather yourself with sun protectant even if you're cooped up indoors to avoid photo aging to an extent. Time for question number three, how often should I reapply sunscreen? Always follow these three rules whenever you're applying sunscreen. The first being a frequent application, second uniform and third coat application. This way the sunscreen will work the best way and in an effective manner. Whether you apply it with the makeup or not during your AM skincare routine, use a foundation on top of your sunscreen or you can also pick a tinted sunscreen for light coverage. Moving on to our last question, how much SPF is a good SPF? SPF is a sun protection factor which measures how well a sunscreen protects skin against the sunburn due to exposure to UVB and UVA rays, the type that causes most skin cancers. It is always recommended to go for at least SPF 30 as it will safeguard the skin 30 times more than the lower values. If you're an outdoorsy person and love to go out in the sun, then pick SPF 50 to do the job for you. I hope I answered all your questions and by now you're fully convinced of how important it is to include the sunscreen into your routine. All of the products that I mentioned are available at vanitywagon.in. Don't forget to like, share and comment and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. I will see you very very soon. Till then, take care. Bye.